Hello and welcome to another episode of our show called, Meet the Gutraxians. Our today's guest is Francis Sommer. I hope this will go better than last time. Mr. Francis Sommer, would you introduce yourself? Hello my name is Francis Omer. I am a cadre who works as a bureaucrat. I do a lot of the boring government work. The good thing about the job is that I have my own computer on which I can work. So I do not have to commute to my job. Which leaves me with more spare time to spend with my neighbors. That is good to hear. What can you tell us about your race, Mr. Francis Sommer? Well, us kaijus are bigger than humans as you can see. Gutraxians in general need to eat less than humans but we are carnivores. We also easily die in low temperatures. This is due to our bodies becoming entirely solid and we die as a result. We can't thermoregulate like humans but can survive temperatures up to 50 degrees Celsius. Also while not all kaijus or gutraxians can do this. I can't transfer humans into kaijus by bidding them or scratching them with my claws. That is, certainly interesting. Regarding the transformation, how does that work? Transformation works by getting injection of assimilative goo into the bloodstream by bites, scratches or by other means. Once inside the bloodstream, the goo starts transforming the body into a gutraxian, depending on what type of goo it is. However this is not the proper way to transfer someone. Because this way the transferred person loses half of their sapience. The proper way to do is to put a person into a chamber and have the chamber with naked person inside it, flooded with assimilative goo for a day. This way the person transferred have their mind in one piece. Would you be tell us more? It's alright if you don't want to. No I will not tell you more. However I think my neighbor Jody Ulatl will be able to tell you more. Now I would appreciate if you with your camera human would leave, so I can go upstairs.